two, three, four, one. You're no good. Stay out of the vlog, please. Can you can you come do an intro? He's still camera shy, guys. I don't I don't know what's up with him. Just look at him, guys. Oh my gosh. He doesn't want to say anything. He just doesn't want to say a word every single time. Welcome back to the vlog, guys. Today, I'm going to be doing some iPhone secrets. Actually, if I do, because I'm going to buy the new iPhone right now. And then iOS 11 is going to be out. So, I want to show you guys some secrets with that. If I'm not going to do that, it's going to be awkward. Because I'm talking about it in the video right now. So, it's going to be kind of weird. So, let's get started with today's vlog. Today's notification shout-out goes to this guy over here. So, shout-out to you for turning on channel notifications. If you want a shout-out, all you have to do is turn on channel notifications. And you, uh, like, the dog's whining. What you going to do? When I'm vlogging, official new rules. You look at the camera first. And then you, you don't... You, you don't whine, okay? That's all you have to do. It's not that hard. Listen to me. No, no, you can't do that here. Never mind, he's not listening. So yeah, also subscribe to the channel, leave a like because um, I'm almost at a million subscribers. It's gonna be pretty sick when I reach a million subscribers. Okay, dude, that's a big distraction in my channel. Now you just follow me around. Come on, dude. Dude, I don't think he knows his name still. Ooh. Day two. All right, guys, so the iPhone. He's gone, he's running away. Danny, come back. We need to so basically, you guys already saw iPhone unboxing. We're just gonna unbox it really quick here. iPhone, we got all this, we got all that. Let me set it up real quick and I'll be right back. Alrighty, so now that I'm back, iOS 11 has come out recently and I'm pretty sure even if you don't have an iPhone 8, you still have iOS 11. So I wanna show you guys some, I'm just put them down. Let's start with some iOS 11 hacks. If you don't have iOS 11, make sure to download it. It's on your settings. Okay, I'm just gonna show you guys if you don't know. All you have to do is just go to settings and then go on general, go on, I don't even know, but figure it out yourselves. Let's get started with the iPhone hacks. So the first one is going to be, so the first one is if you're FaceTiming someone, you can have a more clear, um, Wait, more Joe, clear screenshot. Just, Let's, no, no, let me just call you. There's a step to it. That's uh, not, um, Okay, so it's not gonna work on it. All right, the FaceTime call. If you want a FaceTime call, all you have to do is click that button and you'll get a way more clear screenshot of the picture that you're trying it. to take. So both people have to have iOS 11 in order for this to work. So that's the first 11. one. So this one is pretty sick if you're trying to move apps really quick. So basically what you're gonna do is tap on one and when you're in the process of moving it, tap another one. Can I, can I do that? Yeah, Danny, yeah, I'm gonna go home. Just... Oh, so look, 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 look at that, Danny got it, look at that, You that's make sick. like a little group. You keep oh, tapping oh, it and then and drag it into a new folder. Oh, all the way to the right. That's not a good word on my wallpaper. Bam. Boom. And they all just go right there. Just like, Danny, you just smacked my phone against the table. I just bought this. So if you have a low gigabyte iPhone like the 16, the 32, or even maybe 64, if you want to save space, it's going to be better than just deleting apps. What you want to do is basically go on to, where is it at? iPhone storage right over here. And you can actually see how much, recommendations. yeah, recommendations. You can see what apps you don't even need. Cause like there's, we'll save 1.5 gigabytes of apps that you don't even need. So you can just click on that and it'll give you one and a half gigabytes. That's a lot of storage for, if you ask me. So that's a pretty good one if you're trying to save space on your uh, new iPhone that you got or your old one if you have old iOS 11. Cause... If you have an iPhone 4, I don't think it works for iPhone, uh, iOS well, 11. But the new ones don't come in 16, 32, minimum. Oh yeah, I don't know why I'm brought up saying. Anyways, continuing. This one is gonna be my personal favorite, guys. If you're tired of apps showing you, like rate this app one out of five stars and you have to go to the app store and then rate them because it's forcing you to, what you're gonna do is basically go, where? where you, have to, like, you have to like cancel and then they're like, why do you wanna cancel? Why don't you wanna rate us? Come on, man. Yeah, it gets annoying. So what you're gonna do is go to iTunes and app stores and in-app ratings and reviews, bam. Now it's off. Gone. And you'll never get a notification saying rate this app ever again on your phone. So I'm gonna actually use that one because I'm sick and tired of downloading new apps and, and them saying, oh, rate this app. I don't want to rate your app, okay? I just don't want to rate. If you guys want to talk to Siri without actually talking for like in class or something, you have headphones in, you can actually type to Siri. Look at this, guys. Hey. Sub to David. Hello, Daddy David. Oh, that's awkward. So that is actually pretty sick if you're actually in school or like you're in a quiet area and you want to go, hey Siri, you can just text it to it and it'll be actually a lot better in uh, like if you want more privacy with Siri, if you want to flirt a little bit with Siri. You can just do anything with Siri, what just texting it instead of just actually talking, or if it's like really late at night, you know. I don't know. Whatever you guys do at night, I don't. I don't want to get into that. All right, guys. So basically, for it's my go ahead, my channel. You can tell I me mean, we're both filming this video. Yeah. Whatever. So basically, for this one, it's in the notes. You get to your notes, you make a new note, you click that plus button right there, plus. Click scan document and you get your document, and then you have documents in your notes. I don't know why he had to do that. So much, you know, I'm kind of pissed off. Why would you? Why would you do that to me? Well, then why am I filming with you? Because in the back. no, because I need one, one, one person to make it look cool. All right, guys. So this one is actually gonna be. Oh my gosh, Danny, you're freaking pissing me off. So this one is actually pretty cool. There's new text message effects. So if you use text a lot, so basically I'm gonna type in yo, and you tap and hold on the send button, and you click on screen. 
And look at that, guys. There's a lot of new effects that you can use. Just look at this. Wait, let's see if it works on a 9. Okay, okay. Not I'll, I'll send it on an iOS 10 or whatever. whatever. You oh, sound oh, like Yeah, so I'm gonna have to update. Why wow, you're boring, dude. It didn't even deliver, look. Even though you were... Thing? Damn, you suck, dude. You really suck. You don't have iOS 11, you're irrelevant now. Okay, so for this one, it's actually really cool if you're in an emergency situation, which is kind of rare, but for some people it's really not. I smelled the dog and I was making sure I don't mm -hmm. smell like the dog. Because the dog doesn't smell great. Yeah. Anyways, this one's actually really cool. So basically what you do is you go on emergency SOS, which is on the right below Jen, touch ID passcode. And you also, all, what you do is you click set up emergency contacts. And once you set up an emergency contact, what you can do is instead of finding in a context, if you're like in a really bad situation, you can go like this in your pocket and you click the volume down button and the power button five times in a row. So just right here down below. And you click it five times in a row and it automatically calls and then you can talk without actually going on your phone and dialing it. So that is really cool if you are in a really, really bad situation or just any situation or if, if you're just too lazy. Well, yeah. yeah. If you're just too lazy, call call mom because I'm, I'm just the only person that calls. Them. Yeah, that's uh, the, I think that's the previous to last. No, how do you say it? Previous to last. Second to last. Yeah, second to last. All right guys, so David just left, but I'm gonna say there's one more hack. And basically I know his password because I saw him put it in once. So his password right now, I'm gonna change it to something else. So he thinks his password is what it is, which is a weird password to be honest. But basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change his passcode from to zero 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 zero. I see this thing is easily guessed, but we're, we're, we're going with it. And basically I'm gonna, I'm gonna say that if you hold like all the corners of the screen, he's gonna end password is gonna automatically change to zero 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 so he won't know because he wasn't here while I was changing the password to zero 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 so he'll think that his password is still the same but when he gets back his password is gonna be changed all right it's right here yo so basically can I say this last one you kind of said all you found another secret yeah so look so basically what you do is hey dude whatever come on just I found the secret so you know your passwords like one two is this another secret button thing yeah look. where'd you get this off figured it out myself Sure, check my phone with me. Okay, go. What, what okay, so look. So basically, you hold this corner for one, two, three, four, and then this corner, one, two, three, this seems so four, like and then this corner, one, two, three, okay, four, whatever. and then this corner, one, two, three, four, and then look. When you put your password, in, password, password, and it's automatically zero, 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 and then zero. Okay, but listen. But the reason, the reasoning behind this, look, it, it's, look. it's, it's, because it's like for cops. When they find an iPhone and they need to like get into it because it triggers something because Apple was like getting sued, remember? Did you ever hear about that? No. Did you like change? Wait, let me try, let me try my old passcode, dude. How did you just do that? I'm actually weirded out right now. Let me, let me unlock my, well, oh my gosh. I just need to go on the password. All right. My old password is this. So it's changed. Yeah. So the cops can get in and stuff and like NSA. Seriously. I'm so confused right now. So it's actually legit. Yeah. All right, Danny, do it again. Here. Well, it's already zero zero. No, I'm gonna change the password and you do it again. No, that's fine. One time was enough. If you don't do it again, I'm not gonna believe you that this actually works. Right, well, okay, your I'm gonna make a new password. Okay. Look, you, you changed the password, right? So look, it's not zero 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 zero. Yeah, I obviously changed work. it. Here, do it. All right, so look, so basically now, so now look, so you know your password isn't zero zero zero. I just showed you. Now you just hold this one. Right, use your finger. Why are you using your thumb now? No, it doesn't matter. I used my thumb last time too. Are you stupid? Oh. So one, two, you made me restart. Are you proud? Three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. I swear if it's changed. One, two, three, four. And now watch. No, I swear it. I'm pissing me off. Just tell me how to do it. I actually want to make a video on this. I, That's actually I told sick. you. I told you. Well, you're filming this, so are you pranking me? Or I swear you oh, are. I'm showing it to the audience. And that concludes the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed these uh, life hacks. Danny did something weird to my phone, so I don't know. I'm gonna have to change the password or do something and call an Apple or something. Let me know if that trick actually works for you as well in the comments down below. Comment down below what your favorite trick is for iOS 11. And if you don't have iOS 11, make sure to download it and check out my other vlogs as well. Also, leave a like, comment down below and subscribe to the channel. I'm almost at 1 million subscribers, so please subscribe to the channel to help me reach 1 million subscribers. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Bye.